Hi, everyone. Um, thank you for tuning in. Um, I made a video uh, after I watched Terrence Howard's um, uh, on the Joe Rogan podcast, and I was able to finish the whole thing. It took me about two days. Uh, I have to rewatch it over and over again. Sorry for the mess. I'm trying to let it air dry. Anyways, so here's one thing. If you have watched the Terrence Howard, um, if you've watched that episode, you're going to, maybe you notice, or if you haven't, yeah, uh, but if you haven't, if you have noticed, he seems to be a little angry. Um, and that is because of a lot of things right that we do know and the things that we don't know however the things that i intuitively know is number one when you have that level of aha right he basically reinvented math right so it's like you're gonna be angry at the fact that the world doesn't make sense anymore you have been lied to and you're going to want to feel like pointing a finger and finding out who is it that lied to you and why you know all that stuff right um so i have a message if terrence ever gets to to this and comes to find us there's a dog that never freaking barks but apparently he's barking now anyways um so i have a channeled message uh for terrence um and the, the message goes as follows. The lines are there for a reason. It is not for what you feel they were created for. It is to allow the proper reflection of reality. A clue, if you wish, for those who would like to decode the encryption. The distortion from the natural world would be too scary and incomprehensible for our physical minds to understand. I wrote this all down. Therefore, the evolution of this revelation was needed at this time, but since you cannot understand a light in just darkness or just understand darkness uh, understand darkness in all light, it needed to be projected or shown to us that way. Now, the fact that it was used and misrepresented to serve an ulterior motive. That's completely another story. But essentially, the message is the 90 degree angle was our way for us to understand at least a small portion of the whole. Although the 90 degree angle isn't the basis of it it's a part of it so don't anger and don't don't stay in that anger because obviously you're going to feel anger you're going to feel betrayal betrayal you're going to feel um all those feelings and they're valid they're valid because trust me i went through my whole entire thing too in my um spiritual journey but the whole point is The whole point is, understand that that is too a part of a whole. It's a part of the whole. It doesn't justify the fact that some chose to, as I wrote, misrepresent to serve their ulterior motives. But now, we are at the crux of human evolution and that is exciting and terence you were a part of that you, big reason for that along with everyone else every one of us who has chosen to continuously work on ourselves light beings or not christian or not spiritual or not catholic or not you, you get you get the message 
right? I'm not going to spoon feed it to you. You, you're bright. I know and understand that you are bright enough to get this. So that's my message, my interpretation. Now, I am on his website and I'm going to read. I'm currently on page three of, I believe it's 167 of um, pages of his book. So I'm very excited to dive into that. Um, and yeah, that was the quick message I wanted to give. So yeah, I have more though. So tune in. <laughs>